We're just having a little Rolling. Bit of camera trouble. It's going? Yeah. Cool. Now I can do my game show news. It's been a while since I've recorded on video for those of you watching on YouTube. I thank you for your patience. And here it comes, finally, after a bit of wait, your game show news on KKSM. He's won a million dollars! <laughs> comes if the ah oh, it's not even ready uh there we go got a minute get on the show because minute to win it is casting in the osage event center at uh, million dollar elm casino in uh, i believe that's in norman i think it is i forget but even if you can't make it to that, send your completed application, photo, and a videotape of your audition to the Minute to Win It auditions. Yes, they need contestants for Season 2, and it's going to be awesome. And you can send it to the P.O. Box, P.O. Box 1599 in Studio City, California, 91614-0599. And of course, it all becomes property of NBC, and they're not giving it back to you, so make yourself a copy, okay? Right. And while Minute to Win It is casting for a new season, BBC is canceling a show. 100 Ways to Leave a Game Show has left the airwaves. Why? Wait. I demand to know why! Why? Well, the series saw unsuccessful contestants eliminated in a, diff a whole bunch of different ways. And The Sun claims that BBC executives decided excuse me, to axe the show because they were unhappy with the ratings. Ratings. It's all about the ratings, apparently. But, t but TV producers are reportedly still hoping to work with the pro program's presenter, Steve Jones. Jones recently left T4 after working on the magazine program for seven years. And here's why I'm playing the millionaire theme. There's a special Halloween show today, for those of you who actually watch the, sto the show still. Just in time for Halloween, the ghost will say who, not boo, on a special episode of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, airing today, fe featuring Jason Hawes and Grant Wilson, the lead paranorm paranormal investigators and stars of the sci-fi series Ghost Hunters. And for a note, listings on that, Ch ABC 10 today, and for those of you who are living in Oceanside, Los Angeles area, KTLA 5 today at 12.30. And if you don't live in the San Diego area, you can check out MillionaireTV.com for all the listings. It's going to be interesting seeing paranormal investigators try to figure out the answer to the million dollar question, if they can even get close to it, that is. But at any rate, all their proceeds will go to the Hasbro Children's Hospital in Providence, Rhode Island. That's pretty nice of them, wouldn't you say? I think so. Pretty nice. Yeah, those kids deserve it. By the way, one note on The Millionaire. Uh, look, apparently, Meredith has a new thing going on on her show. She has what? nine contestants, and after a certain amount of contestants, they're all going to come back to the show. These are previous contestants and have a chance at winning $10 million. Ooh, Super Millionaire is coming back. Yeah, so Super Millionaire with Meredith Vieira coming soon to a network near you. Yeah. <laughs> it's just not the same without the hot seat, though, but at least they still get to say final answer. Absolutely. That's what it keeps me going. That's what it keeps you going. Absolutely. Although I wish they would have kept the clock format, because that was my favorite format. And you did mention that they took Phone a Friend away. Apparently, a lot of people complained about that. They did bring Phone a Friend back. Really? Yeah, Phone a Friend is back. I was watching the broadcast via the, our affiliate KTLA the other day, and they've brought Ask the Audience back, Phone a Friend back, hmm. am amongst a few. Wow, I didn't know that. So I'm going to have to check out Millionaire again. My shifts at work have been, like, getting jumbled and whatnot. But nonetheless, I will come back to the show and check it out again. That's your game show news on KKSM Palomar College Radio. You're listening to Corey Evans. Folks, We're good do to not go. change the channel. Only on KKSM Palomar College Radio. <laughs> 